Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everyone. Today I'm going to be showing you where to find Agatinas and Dunk Beetles in Ragnarok. So it's uh, there's a couple places, like two areas where you can find Agatinas. Uh, one of them is hard, a little bit hard to find, the other one is uh, very easy to find. So the, I'm going to show you the first area which is easy to find, and that would be the swamp area, which is north of the Blue Obelisk around 39 and 21. You can't really miss it. It's pretty much the swamp area, the only swamp area in Ragnarok. So, the swamp area in, on Ragnarok is very straightforward. It's a small, swampy area. You can find Planex species. You can find Titan Buzz, Frogs, Parasaurs, Agatinas, Baryon Eggs. Sarcos. Um, what else is out there? Caprosaurus. Okay, pretty much everything that you can find in the swamp. So here, so here, the first part is there's a couple plant X species here on this little tiny island. There's always a guarantee, 100% chance you can find plant X species on this area, which is 36 and 18. Can't really miss it. Very easy if you're looking for plant X. So now I'm gonna show you where to find the Agatinas. So the Agatinas are not that difficult to find, you just have, have to go a little further north. Uh, there's a small chance you can find them in this area of the swamp where there's like a lot of trees. But I um, honestly don't recommend you looking for them in there because it's really hard to see them if you're flying low and there's all, always a chance of a Caprosaurus just snatching you out of the, the bird you might be riding or land dino. You might be right in. So we're gonna go a little further, and you're gonna see this area in here. And this is where most of the Baryonyx and Caprosaurus spawns. So there's a Baryonyx there, if you're looking for Baryonyx. But if we go further to the coast, we should be able to see Agatinas. Although the RNG spawn is, it can be random. Sometimes you see uh, a large number of carnivores, and they'll be killing all the Agatinas as you're as you're looking for one. So it really depends on what you're doing, and if you don't see any Akatinas, you might want to clear as many carnivals as you can. Oh, here's one. Here's one Akatina. And there's another one over here, you're getting attacked by a Titan Boa. I will save you! Oh no. Oh well, it's too late. Indeed. So this pretty much is the, the easiest area to find Akatinas. And if you don't see one, uh, what I would recommend you is just, just to clear as many dinos as you can to force a respawn. And you'll find more. If you keep going further north, you're gonna hit the wall and there is nothing there. If you're looking for frogs, you'll find most of the frogs. Uh, the chances of finding a Katina is always like a... Seems to be like a 70-30%. It really depends on how many carnivores have spawned. And how many things you have to clear to force a respawn. This time around I did find one. Let's see. If I can find another one. Although I always had a very low chance of finding more if I keep going this direction. But you never know. So what's the chance of them of one spawning here? And here's another one. So pretty much this whole area is a, a high chance of finding Akitinas. But like I said, you have to keep in mind that carnivores are spawned constantly. So there's a chance that you may not find a single one because all of them are getting killed. Or you might find a lot because you kill all the carnivores. So it really depends on the RNG, but this is the most, the easiest area to find Akitinas. Now I'm going to show you a second spot where there's like a small percentage chance of finding Akatinas and just in case you're flying through that area and you're like oh let me see if there's Akatina there let me show you now all right guys so I'm gonna so here's the second area where you will find Akatinas although this is kind of a rare spawn because depending on how many players are in the game on depending on on how many wild dinos are in the game there's a chance you may or may not find 
Hackathon. So there's like an 80, 30% chance that you will not find one here, but this is uh, one of the spawns for Hackathonas, which is located at 26 and 47. This is kind of like the heavy griffin spawn area. So usually Hackathonas spawn around the river. Oh, and there is one. Oh, I got lucky here. So there's one right there. And this is one of the areas where you will find them, although, like I said before, it's extremely rare for you to see one. Let me see if you can find another one. No, oh, I think that's the only one. They're like a little bit hard to find because it's terror birds constantly spawning in here, so they will kill them very quickly. There's also T Rex that's not spawn here, though. May kill them very quickly. So there's that one. Is that one dead? I think it might be dead. So yeah, this is one of one of the spawns where you will find an Akitina as well. So this is one of those places that you might be flying by and be like, oh let me see if there's Akatina here and, and if you find one we're good. If you don't you might as well just go to the swell for a guaranteed spawn. So now let me show you where to find dung beetles. Alright guys, so I'm going to show you the next area where you can find dung beetles. It's pretty straightforward. It's honestly pretty much the entire volcanic area. And that is around the 23, 20, 64 area. This whole area, this pretty much the whole area surrounding the volcano. You will find dung beetles. There's actually a dung beetle right below me, but there's a large number of dinos that might kill me if I try to land. And honestly, this is the best place, well, the only place that I'm aware of where you can find dung beetles. And if you fly around the whole area, you will definitely find some. Sometimes it will be a little harder to see. It really depends on the RNG. There's a couple that's two in here as well. And and that's pretty much it. Like, there's, there's no, there's no like, I don't, Dragon doesn't have like caves on like the island where you can go in there and find dung beetles. They're pretty much just all around the volcanic area. And they're really easy to find, really easy to tame too. You don't even need ghillie armor. Uh, a lot of people make the mistake of having to bring ghillie armor and bug repellents. But you can just, if you sneak behind one, like a low level one, which is a large piece of dino poop, you can pretty much just tame it instantly. So it really depends on the RNG and what you're looking for, how much time you have available, but most of the time you will find dung beetles pretty much everywhere in here. And they're, they're not that complicated, so it's very straightforward. Probably the easiest place, the easiest map to find dung beetles, hands down. Anyway, I hope everyone enjoyed this guide, and if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.